Unit 4, Lesson 15. How often do you have English class? Usarán los adverbios de frecuencia para preguntar acerca de su horario de clases. Hola. En la lección anterior, resolvimos ejercicios de los temas que hemos visto en esta unidad. Miren. She dances and listens to pop music. Welcome. Hi. Hello. My name is Gabriela. My friends call me Gabby, and I love fashion. <laughs> Very well, Gabriela. Do you go to school? Mm, yes, I go to school on weekdays. On Saturday, I work at the Wacamaya Reserve in Simol. <laughs> mm, do you have other hobbies besides fashion? Mm, yes, I read fashion magazines, and I watch music videos. <laughs> mm, do you have a favorite singer? Yes. I do. It's Ronnie Williams. Thank you very much, Gabriela. Welcome our next contestant. He plays football every day. Mm -hmm. He's a huge mm -hmm. sports fan mm -hmm. and he loves rock music. Mm -hmm. Hi, my name is Angel. Mm -hmm. I love sports and music. And uh, uh, what else? I don't know, Angel. Do you like food? Mm -hmm. Yes, I do. What do you have for breakfast? Mm, I have some apple juice and a sandwich. Mm. Thank you very much. And now for our final contestant. Mm. 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 Hi, I'm Diego. Mm. Is that all? Mm. Yes. Mm? <laughs> <laughs> I think he's a little shy. <laughs> mm. <laughs> Diego, do you like sports? Mm. Yes. Uh, mm. He says he likes sports. He loves football and baseball. And he doesn't like tennis. Hola, chicos. En la lección del día de hoy, vamos a proponer a la maestra Neida que nuestros horarios de clase sean modificados. Más recreo y artes. Vamos a ver qué sucede. Hello, class. Hola. Today, Hola. we're going to do a special exercise. We are going to talk about your activities and how often you do them. For example, mm, mm, Gabriela, how often do you brush your hair? I brush my hair four times a day. Oh, too often. I never brush my hair. <laughs> okay. How often do you study math at home? I never study math, but I definitely have a math class five times a week. Mm, apuesto a que tu mamá le será muy interesante esta información. No, maestro. If my mom finds out, I will be punished. <laughs> Listen, kids. We are going to make a list of activities and how often you do them. And then mm -hmm. you are going to show me your reports. Hey, Gabs. Hagamos una encuesta a los chicos del salón sobre sus actividades. Así, podemos pedir más tiempo de recreo y más clases de artes para mostrarles que necesitamos tiempo para hacer las cosas que nos gustan. Mm, no suena mal. Mm. Luego se la presentamos al profesor Martín y vemos qué sucede. Sí. For example, how often do you do sports? Or how often do you read a comic? <laughs> pues hay que hacerlo. Mm -hmm. hmm. A ver, creo que ya tenemos todas las preguntas y las opciones. Déjame ver. Están bien, ¿no? Uh -huh. Seguro con esto, la maestra Eneida y el maestro Martín deben ajustar los horarios. ¿Ya terminaron el ejercicio? Justo estaba pensando en que tú deberías ser el primero en contestar nuestro cuestionario. ¡Muy bien! ¡Estoy listo! <risa> How often do you do sports? I play soccer four times a week. How 
How often do you go to the movies? Mm, I go to the movies once a week. Mm -hmm. <laughs> How often do you read a comic? Mm, I read a comic twice a week. Mm -hmm. <laughs> How often do you watch a program of contemporary art mm -hmm. on television? Mm -hmm. What? No, never! Hey, Diego, mm. I watch those programs often. They are great! <laughs> okay, class, let's see your questionnaires mm -hmm. and find out how often you do things. We've finished them, sir. And we want to ask you for a favor. We want to have a meeting with you and Miss Eneida. Mm. This exercise was very interesting. It will help us to organize our schedules better. Mm -hmm. Huh? Uh, 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 ahora sí me dejaste sorprendido, Ángel. ¿Cómo está eso de que el cuestionario va a ayudar a mejorar las clases? Mm. Maestro Martín, ¿le parece si leemos nuestro reporte para que podamos hablar con usted y la maestra Eneida? Hicimos un reporte muy completo. Go ahead, then. Listen to the results of this report. Mm -hmm. Then we have some suggestions. Mm. First question. Hmm. How often do you do sports? And the results are... One of the students never does sports. Four of the students do sports three times a week. Five of the students do sports five times a week. And four of the students do sports every day. <laughs> Gabriela, continue, please. Mm -hmm. Second question. How often do the students watch a program of contemporary art on television? Mm. Here are the results. <clears throat> mm. One of the students never watches an art program. Three students watch art programs twice a week. Mm. Four students watch art programs five times a week. Mm. And two students watch art programs every day. Mm. <laughs> Very interesting. But why do you and Angel want to talk with Miss Eneida and me? Very simple. Because these questions reflect the interests of students. Mm -hmm. And maybe this report can make you change some of our activities and give us more time for recess. Mm -hmm. hmm. I need to discuss that with Miss Eneida. Hmm? Mm -hmm. <risa> Seguimos la siguiente clase con los ejercicios Hasta mañana Good morning, teacher Can I come in? Of course you can, Diego Do you have your exercise? Your frequency questions? Actually, no I don't know what to do I want to do something mm, Different mm. Él podría hacer la encuesta sobre el rendimiento académico no, no es, es mala, mala idea. idea. Te propongo algo, Diego. ¿Por qué no me ayudas con un proyecto que tengo para la escuela? Y así tú presentas tu ejercicio y me ayudas con una actividad de la escuela. Uh -huh. <risa> Suena muy bien, maestro. ¿Ya tiene las preguntas? But you have to do it in English, huh? Of course. I'll do it right now. <risa> Great. Here are the questions. Mm. Mm. Martin always has such great ideas. Are you ready for the questions, Rogelio? Yes, I'm ready. Go ahead. How often do you read a book? I read a book once a month. How often do you review your class notes? I review my class notes every two months. Mm -hmm. You know, because teachers do tests. Mm. <laughs> How often do you go to the library? Mm. I go to the library once a month. Mm -hmm. mm. How often do you study mathematics? Uh, um, uh, I never study math. <laughs> Too many numbers. I get dizzy with all those math problems. Mm. How often do you see an educational program on television? Mm. 
I see an educational program on television five days a week in telesecundaria. <laughs> Thank you, Rogelio. Hey, Mario! All right, class. Listen, please. Miss Oneida and I have been considering your proposals about the school schedule and how much time we spend on each class. You kids did a splendid job with your questionnaires. Angel and Gabriela handed in an interesting report, but Diego did a totally different one. Hmm? <laughs> What do you mean, a totally different one? You'll see in a few minutes. Quiero aclarar que los chicos están muy interesados mm -hmm. en que se tomen en cuenta los resultados de las encuestas mm -hmm. para poder mejorar su rendimiento escolar mm -hmm. y dar mayor número de horas a aquellas actividades que necesiten de su atención. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Let's listen to Diego's report. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. For this report, I ask the following question. How often do you study mathematics? And the results are... Five of the students never study mathematics. Three of the students study mathematics twice a week. And two students study mathematics once a week. Very good. Thank you, Diego. Muy bien, muchachos. Hemos tomado en cuenta estos reportes y hemos llegado a la conclusión de que vamos a ampliar el horario de receso. ¿Ya ves, Gabs? ¡Lo conseguimos! El recreo se va a ampliar 15 minutos más para poder leer y repasar los apuntes de matemáticas. Ya que hemos visto, de acuerdo a sus reportes, que es una de las materias que más atención necesitan. Gracias, chicos. Y muy buen trabajo. ¿Ya ves? Sí, claro que ampliaron el recreo. Pero para ponernos a repasar matemáticas. Bueno, yo dije que quería más recreo, pero no sabía para qué íbamos a utilizarlo. Hola, en la lección de hoy utilizamos los adverbios de frecuencia para hablar de qué tan seguido se realiza una actividad. Recordemos esto. How often do you do sports? Mm. Mm. I play soccer four times a week. How often do you go to the movies? Mm. I go to the movies once a week. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. How often do you read a comic? Mm. I read a comic twice a week. Mm -hmm. How often do you watch a program of contemporary art on television? Mm? What? No, never. Ahora ya saben que los adverbios de frecuencia los utilizamos para decir qué tan seguido realizamos nuestras actividades cotidianas. Hasta la próxima lección.